Hey guys, and welcome to my channel, Systematic Motivation, ascending the youth into the STEM field one rocket at a time. On today's at-home activity, we will be creating a lava lamp. Now this is my first video, so please be nice. Thank you guys so much. So first, all of these products that I'm using can be bought at the Dollar Tree. Yes, I said it, Dollar Tree. As you can see, to create our lava lamp, we will need some cheap cooking oil, get any kind of glass vase, any kind of holder to, to hold your water, and some food coloring, any color of your choice. And so these are called Effordant tablets. It's really just a fizz tablet. Just at your local CVS, Walmart, um, and dollar store as well. So, are you guys ready to get started? You're gonna take your cylinder, you're gonna place it on any kind of um, metal pan. I used a metal pan and just wrapped it in aluminum foil. So you'll take your glass cylinder, you're gonna pour in enough vegetable oil generated, okay? So, as you guys can already see, um, I probably had a little bit of water from cleaning this out. I had a little bit of water inside already, so that's where all of the bubbles are formed. Now, you're gonna take your water. Since water is more dense than oil, the water should sink all the way to the There's completely two different layers. You have your oil layer and you have your water layer. Here is where it gets pretty fun. So, using any food coloring of your choosing, you can use one, but today I'm gonna use three just to make this a little bit more cool. Maybe about two red. About two yellow. So, as you guys can see, as the food coloring is dropping into the oil, it's staying solid because the food coloring is more dense as well than the oil. So it's gonna drop to the bottom. You can already see how it's dispersing in the water as it should. Let me show you guys. Now the fun is gonna begin. So you're gonna take your fizz tablet and you're gonna drop it right in. Something forming within the bubbles. What's happening here is the fizz tablets are releasing carbon dioxide gas. Let's just watch that for a little while and look at how mesmerizing this is. And since it looks a little dark, I'm going to add in some more colors. Ooh, that's super pretty. You see how all of that's mixing and the carbon dioxide bubbles are rising and then falling back down. Let me turn it around so you guys can see this. Thank you guys so much for watching. So this was just my first video. There's definitely more to come. This first one was just experimenting with carbon dioxide and understanding density. Knowing that when something is more dense, it's heavier, so it's gonna sink. And when liquids are less dense, they're gonna float like the oil that's inside. 
Thank you guys so much. Please subscribe. If you have any more questions or want to see any other fun at home activities to get your student involved in STEM, please comment below. Head over to my website. The link will be down below. That is www systematicmotivation.com again www.systematicmotivation.com please like and subscribe and follow us on social media instagram facebook and twitter 